Welcome back campers, it's Barry here with Southern RV and behind me I've got a 2021 Venture RV Stratus 231 VRB. This is about a 23 foot box and it weighs just under 6,000 pounds dry. This is a pretty cool little travel trailer built with couples in mind. It has one slide on the off door side and some pretty neat features that we're going to take a look at. So hang tight and we'll get into it. So right at the front of the Stratus, one of the things that we notice is that this does come with a electric tongue jack. And back in behind it, we have a built-in battery cutoff switch that you can see right there. Got a nice rock guard up front, and that is an automotive, automotive grade windshield on the front that looks down into the bedroom. So that's gonna let a lot of light in. We have this massive awning, it's electric. It covers pretty much the length of the RV. We'll throw a picture of it up out towards the end of the video. And right up front here, we have a pass-through storage. This is a slam latch with a magnetic catch. So just push up and it locks into place. And we'll peek down in there and you'll see that it's a fair amount of storage inside. Down low, we have electric landing gear with individual uh, connection points so we can extend or retract each one individually. They move pretty quick as you can see. Looking down a little lower, notice that we have our spare tire on the underside and this shows that we have an enclosed underbelly. Oh, let's hop back up. This does have external speakers outside and then if we look down low here we'll notice that we have power as well as a cable out if we wanted to put a TV out here as well. Our front entrance is solid step with a nice large grab handle and on their cool little marker here they do have a little bottle opener. I thought that was a fun little addition right by the door. The back features where it's pre-wired for a backup camera, as well as a ladder heading up to that walkable roof. If we look down low on the bumper here, what we notice is that we have an accessory hitch. This is a two inch hitch. It is a maximum load capacity of 250 pounds. So that's gonna be good for like a bike rack or a cargo rack or something of that nature. That's your cable and satellite in feed. There is an outside shower, and of course that's gonna be right above our connection point for sewer. There's the slide that we were discussing. And then pushing back up towards the front of the vehicle, notice that we have the pass-through storage hatch on this side as well. That's the exterior of the vehicle. One more thing I should mention is that this does have a solar panel on board. So it is built to trickle charge a 12 volt system. And that's going to be right up here. We'll put in a little drone shot so that you can see it. All right, let's push to the inside of the vehicle. Okay, so when we first come up in the Venture, we see that it has a nice open floor plan. It feels kind of like one large continuous room. Our slide is out, and in the slide, we just have this U-shaped dinette, which can convert to a second bed, and our 
12 volt refrigerator from Furion. The bed at the back or at the front of the trailer has storage up underneath and closets on either side. One thing that I think is pretty neat that they did is they pulled the closet and cabinetry forward and gave essentially what boils down to little nightstands here in the corners. And those have power and USB on both sides. Another cool thing about this bedroom is that they have windows on either side that you could open up. That way you could get a cross breeze across the bed. So instead of having a dining table, this particular unit has this kind of uh, bar stool set up right here under the TV with these stools so you can sit and kind of eat at the breakfast table there with the TV right above it. That TV is on a swivel so it can come out and face left or right. The kitchen. I love this two-tone cabinetry as well as this like live edge look countertop. Here we have a glass top three burner stove with the oven down beneath. A big single basin stainless steel sink. Now that does come with some covers that go out and over it so that you can extend your countertop. We've got a microwave up top there. Inventure gives this presentation slash cutting board out with their RVs as well. When we first came through the door, we're encountering two doors here. The right one is going to be our bathroom. The left one is gonna be a closet space. Let's open that up and take a look. There's our closet space, nice and deep. One of the things that I like that they did is they didn't run the drawers all the way to the front, so that's gonna leave space to stack up a broom or a vacuum or things of that nature. And then our bathroom has a foot flush toilet that we see right here. And then the shower itself is a glass enclosure corner shower. Pretty nice and spacious. And then you see that we've got our medicine cabinet, our stainless steel sink, and some storage down beneath it. And guys, that kind of wraps up the interior of this particular RV without doing some demonstrations of how to make that U-shaped dinette into a bed, but that's pretty simply done. So if you have any questions about it or you'd like to see more or have a virtual tour, just give us a Shoot us an email at sales at southernrv.com or you can give us a call at 770-477-0552 or come see us in person here at the dealership in McDonough. We're at 324 Industrial Boulevard right off of I-75 between exits 216 and 218. Until next time, happy RVing. <laughs>